Hello, everybody. <clears throat> this is a kind of like a sip with me, but I'm just checking in with y'all, see how y'all week is doing. Um, I just got off work at 9. It's 10. Hey, Kara. I just got home. I just come and check in with y'all to see what y'all was doing, how y'all week was going before I um, get in the shower. And then my night with Palace. Say, hey, girl. <laughs> we just chilling. Priscilla, they say they love you. I mean, Palace, they say they love you. Priscilla says she loves you. Um, yeah, I'm off Friday. I'm off Friday, but I have to, um, work Saturday overnight. I do a little bit on Sunday. Oh, I miss you too, Jaden's mommy. Yes, we are doing good. Uh, I think I'm gonna try to have game night on Friday, but I just have to, um... I just have to see if it's going to be copyrighted. If it's going to be copyrighted, then we'll probably have to do it on Instagram or TikTok. I don't know how I'm going to pull that off. And stop in the house. But I'll still go live on YouTube. But um, And I might have to play some, um, go actually buy some card games. But I do want to play Family Feud, so I'm like, that one might be copyrighted, but I'm like, I'm not for sure. What's up, TJD? You know, just getting off of work. No, I'm not in bed yet. I had to go to, um, well, this morning I had to get up. I dropped Mr. Man off to work. And then I had to go to some type of training and it was literally only 30 minutes. So I'm just like, why did I get up this early to go to a training? It was only 30 minutes. It was like a waste of time, but oh well. I mean, I got paid for it, but it was just like, what the fuck? And then I went to, uh, uh, I got my car detailed to kill some time. So I'm just like, I could have went to work, but I'm just like, I don't want to go to work that early and like clean up all day when I could have just went home and cleaned my own house, but I'm, I wasn't driving that far back home. So I got my car detailed and then I went to Jimmy John's for lunch, never been there, asked the lady what they recommended and got a sandwich and I just gave it the other half to Mr. Man and um, I did a Target pickup and got Palace some more food, mark yourself in some um, toothpaste. What's up, Jackie, baby? And then I just went to work from 1 to 9. And that's it. Um, I got to go vacuum my floor. Well, I'll probably do it in the morning, but... You say you need to be asleep? Girl, we almost hit it that way. We almost hit that way. I bought me a um I bought me a deep freezer and it's coming tomorrow. So I'm like I'm trying to get ready for the winter fall. It was like a hundred degrees today and then all of a sudden it decided to rain. Which I already knew was gonna rain. Hey Fluffy, how was the baby? But if y'all need to go get y'all a deep freezer, go get y'all one because I only paid one sixty two for it and it was like uh I want to say it was 198 at first or something like that. It was something. Yeah, it was like 198 or something. And when I clicked on it and put it in my cart, it took $40 off. It was on rollback. Because I never did get the one that was in Walmart that day. Because I ended up getting COVID. And that was, was 125 but it was white. Hey, Gwen. Yeah, I'm in um, STL. Yeah, I'm here. And that was white, but the one I got is black. 
And then I just ordered another, uh, hell no, how they gonna trip and I'm paying for the electricity. You just stocked yours up with stuff? Now I said I might have to go to uh, Costco or Sam's Club and really get with it. Dang, I see y'all had y'all's first appointment. What, what was it, today or yesterday? Yeah, 162 is, is good for that price. Oh, He surprised you with a white one. Yes, yeah, so I'm just like, mm-mm. Yeah, I'm just like, I always pay my bills. You know, I'm like, I may not pay them on time, but I'm like, I pay them. But Lord, they had the nerve to send me, uh, talking about if I don't pay them $200 by, uh, by the 30th, they're going to disconnect me. What? Over $200? Y'all tripping. I went on and gave it to them. I'm like, y'all hella And they still be doing the same shit they be doing. I'm like, y'all just don't know. I'm I ain't that motherfucking broke to be not paying my bills now. I ain't that motherfucking broke to be not paying my bills now. Hey, Amanda. Yeah, they was tripping. Um, what else happened? Oh, I'm gonna, well, it's not really gonna be like a wig review, but I forgot who had, um, I forgot who asked me to do another uh, colored wig. And I really did like Sunshine. I like that company. So I ordered it from um, Amazon. And it was $38. And it's coming Friday. But I probably won't even do... I probably won't even show y'all Friday. I'll probably just uh, do a video on it Saturday. So are you in STL? Because it definitely was nice for earlier. Yeah, I'm in STL right now as we speak. Hey, Leslie. So, yeah. You know, and I'm about my phone about to go. I saved 65 dollars a day because I took the insurance off. And the duty on them all I need was hella cool. So, basically, he told me, uh, you about to be done paying your iPad. You got one more $25 to pay. And you can take your $40 off. But keep this line open for twenty dollars. I said, you know, like disconnecting the line, and if I want to upgrade my phone or whatever, I can just use that to upgrade it to a um, iPhone fourteen, which I'm not, cause ain't nothing wrong with my phone. Instead of paying using your insurance and paying a deductible of two fifty, and then them sending me a refurbished phone. So he came in clutch for that. So my phone bill's gonna go down. So I'm like, I save sixty-five dollars a day. Hey, RM. Hey, Gwen. I will try to get that together. I mean, I was thinking about something, but I was like, mm, I had to step back and was that rethink some things. And I also bought another one of those um, dresser things because I need one for my clothes. Like, literally, this is all clean clothes right here. All clean clothes. And I just don't have nowhere to put them. I got clothes right there. I got clothes in the closet. I got clothes underneath my bed. I got clothes in my other room. Um, what else? Um, I think that's all that my week has been doing, for real. I just been going to work a little bit earlier than usual. Dang, pallets. You just want to be in the camera, don't you? Oh, excuse me. Y'all, I want to get a fish tank. I think I'm going to try to uh, 
tell me she's gonna give me one for uh Christmas. Even though I mean I can do it right now, but I'm a um I'm a I'm a research what fish I want. I'm like I want a goldfish, but I'm like I want more than a goldfish. Palace will be two in November. So I guess she's about to be fourteen in dog years and two in human years. Palace, we're gonna get you a birthday outfit. But um, how y'all been doing? Is your week good to this this week? I saw I got a bump or something right here. Oh, that hurts so bad. Ooh, that hurt so bad. See, it's been a minute since I've caught you cooking. Do you still make cook videos? Um, honestly, I've had, I mean, I do cook, but I'm just like, mm, uh, I don't even know what to cook for real. I've been on TikTok and I did save a few video stuff that I want to do. And I'm like, honestly, I was thinking about start, um, Showing y'all what we cook at work. Because um, one time I had made a menu and it was cool. And then we just kind of started making a menu. So, who was it, Sunday? No, I worked Saturday. And my boss had put on a beef. I don't know, I guess you can call it a beef. I don't know what it's called. I don't know. It was just like a big piece of meat and he put it in a crock pot and it seasoned it up and everything. And it was like falling off the bone. I don't know if it was pork, pork roast or beef roast, one of them. And one day they had those for some greens. What I had? I think it was like some greens, that and something else. And then the next day I had made them a pulled pork uh, sandwich. And then yesterday... They had Spanish rice, refried beans with some little cheese on it. And we had made them tacos out of that meat. So I'm like, we just, you know, be making stuff stretch. And I'm like, that really did stretch because I'm like, it was a whole, whole lot. And then last night we had put some beans on with the uh, rest of the little um, turkey, turkey leg or ham hock, whatever they had in there. Somebody they had that today and tomorrow some cornbread and then this weekend they'll have something totally different. So I mean it's like almost like a a busy schedule, you know, with them going to program and it's like us the workers are kinda like the parents and you know, we just meal prepping and always got a busy day after program school type thing. Um so yeah, I guess I'll start showing y'all what we cook there. I want to do hibachi night with them. I mean, I don't know how they're going to act, but maybe we can do hibachi night with them. I'll bring my griddle and uh, we can make some rice and everything. You know, put some juice on there, some grilled onions. The headband wig in your hall looks good. Thank you, girl. You know what? And I didn't put the code in there because I went back and tried to see if my code still worked and it doesn't work. My thing is with uh, wig companies, I feel like that if y'all want us to keep the video up, then keep my code active. Because you never know. There might be somebody who watches my video Today, as soon as I post it, use the code, they get the discount. But somebody new comes to my channel six months later and sees it or was like, oh, where you get that from? Let me go check it out. And then y'all want to buy it and my coupon code doesn't work. Like, I don't understand that. It's, 
it's weird. So I'm like, that's why I didn't even um, put the code there. And I'm just like, I knew somebody was going to ask, but then again, I'm just like, bro, why am I still promoting y'all? And my code don't even work. No. So, yeah. That little thing just got fucking bigger. I'm trying to tell you, it's something in there. Tell us what you're doing. What you got in your mouth? Let me see. Why you gotta keep chewing on something? Yeah. Hey, demon. But yeah, I just slapped this bad boy in today because I had washed my hair. I blow dried it out. And I used some of uh naturally us naturals oil. I ain't even gonna cap. That's some good ass oil. When I tell you that I the first time I braided my hair, I braided while it was wet. And it looked trash. Like it was braided, but it didn't look braided. Last night I braided my hair. Baby. I braided my hair like you be seeing when them girls sitting in the chair and finna get a full uh a full sew in. I'm like, I did that. I was quite proud of myself for that one. I said I about to start doing my own stuff. And I would like to I gotta find my rollers. But I'm not really trying to dye my hair no more right now. So that's why I'm about to just start wearing wigs and get braids. But I'm just like, mm, I want the braids to match my hair. But I'm like, baby, I don't want no, I don't know. I just want it to match. But I wouldn't mind a roller set to do my hair in a roller set since I got that blow dryer. That would be good. Mm. Did y'all see that? Do it again, Paulus. Is he from North Carolina? Gonna raise up. Take your shirt off. Here, get it, Mama. It's like a helicopter. Y'all, she be jumping way high. Is it late over there where y'all at or what? Well, it's almost 10.30 here. I was going to go live earlier, but I'm like, it was kind of loud. I mean, um, kind of loud at work. I was trying to do it earlier. And then I didn't want to do it too, too early because... I figured about y'all would probably be at work in school. <laughs> I remember last year or so when you were dyeing your hair different colors, it was fun watching you. Yeah, um, I think I don't, well, I ain't gonna say I did every color, but I did a lot. Every time I dye my hair, I still keep the bottle so I know which one I did. We in Citrus on. Dang, hella early in Cali. 822. Boy, when it be so early, like in California and stuff like that, I really be feeling it up here. Because I be like, baby, I be in the bed by like 1130. Or maybe like one something, but this one right here. You saw her to get in the bed, she gone. How was they say you'll get in your bed? She's like, who? Right here. Right here. Right 
Where are you going? It's 1022 in Alabama. Oh, girl, you right next door. I feel like it's like hella late for some reason. Maybe I just been up for a long time. Palisade said, hey. But I got one of my new nightgowns. I'm gonna put that bad boy on. Hey, Yolanda. Maybe one day you can do an SCLC. You know what? I mean, like, okay. What, like, I need somebody to make me, like, an itinerary or whatever, because I swear, like, I'm, like, I only freaking work, and when I go to work, it be midday, like, 2, 3 o'clock to, like, 9 or 10. So, I'm just like, I don't feel like nothing, nothing be, like, open for me to do or, like, I don't know. I don't know. It's just different. I've almost been living here a year. It would be a year in December. But everybody's pretty much nice to me. I haven't had no altercations with nobody. Um... I've had a few people ride my ass on the freeway, and I had to brake check them, which they should know. Get up off my ass, but I mean, any, mm, but other than that, everybody's pretty nice. Um, I think one of these weekends, oh, matter of fact, okay, so after I left Texas Roadhouse and I came home, I wanted to go to, uh, I guess that it's called Forest Park, and they had the hot air balloons, and it was, like, supposed to be lighting up. So, I'm like, you could see them, like, lighting up or whatever. And then, like, the next day, they all got in the air. I didn't even see none of them. I started to go, but I don't know. Me and Mr. Man kind of got into it, so I was just like, I ain't finna invite you, and I ain't finna tell you about it, even though he already knew about it after the fact. And I didn't want to go by myself because it was late. Um, so that's when I just decided to do the trial hall instead. What's the hardest part about being a DSP? I was going to apply. My friend doesn't. She said the worst was a client by her. Oh, damn. Uh, at this moment in time uh, with my clients, I don't think anything is too hard for me. It's just one that just has a really smart ass mouth and I got a smart ass mouth and it just, it just kind of irritates you. Like yesterday I was irritated. Like I was just like, you know what? I'm good. I'm just like, when I'm like, when y'all not listening and I'm trying to, you know, keep y'all safe and keep myself safe and you're not listening to me and you're not paying attention to think you know so much. That's when I get mad because now you making me feel like I'm not I'm not doing my job or I'm being overprotective and then when you around other people they might see it differently, you know what I mean? So yeah. I'm like I, I don't even know if I can really even give y'all an example. Um uh I don't know if I can really give you an example, but um, I have not had any, like, altercations with any clients or anything like that. When I stopped working with my um, client, like, years, years ago, I said I was not going to work with no more behavior people because I'm like, it was just so stressful. Like, I couldn't wait to get home. Like, I love working with him, but when you go to work and he had a bad day, it was just pure hell. But... I don't have to deal with that really anymore. So I'm just like, I don't, you know, I'm not stressed out. Like, I can come home and just be cool. Hey, uh, 
say. Oh, you in Illinois, Patricia? Oh, that's right. You did say you was. But I don't know. It just depends on what type of clients you get. Yeah, that's what it was. The balloon racing force part. You say you got fast reflexes? Well, girl, I can't, uh, I can't, um, say too much, but I got reflexes too. Like, I'm gonna defend myself regardless. I don't give a fuck. I can't touch you. Okay. Hey, Rosie. But yeah, that's what it was. It was a balloon race. Um, I'm gonna start looking on, uh, like googling and seeing what stuff happens in STL so that way I can go. Right now my focus is for October. Uh we already bought like a spooky it's a spooky Oreo house. Kinda like you know you build the uh gingerbread house. So Mr. Man bought one for he bought one from um Let me turn around. He bought this one. Hey girl. So it's a Halloween Oreo house cookie. So we're gonna do that one. Um I actually want to take uh pictures. So last year I seen this couple. Hey boss June. Hey no girl, how do you say your name? N A W A L T N Nal T N Nawal. We got to come up with a nickname for you until I get it right. Um, oh, Fatima. Oh, I can dig that, Fatima. Okay, where is it at? Oh, oh. oh, I'm about to answer somebody's question. Well, not that one. Okay. So I kind of want to do this one with Mystery Man so that way we don't show our faces and we can still, you know, like, do something, you know, that involves couples and, you know, for the holidays and, you know, stuff like that, you know. So I kind of want to do that. Um, where is your next trip going to be? Any plans? Uh... Honestly, I don't know. My homegirl just asked me that I want to go to Vegas next month. And I told her no because I'm like, I'm trying to get ready for I'm trying to get ready for Christmas and stuff like that. And freaking my dad, he wants all of his kids to like go on a trip together. So I have to hit my sisters up and ask them where do they want to go. And let's make a plan for it. Hey, Crystal. You said, what am I going to be for Halloween? Um, I think I'm going to try to be uh, Lilo from Lilo and Stitch. Hold on, y'all. Let me show y'all. I just got to figure out how to do this last little piece. But I think I got a, um, a bump right here. I was just trying to freaking... 
busted, I guess, or whatever you want to say. This is what I want to do. I've got the red Bantu in my, or what you call that thing? I got the red shirt in my Amazon cart. I can get the blaze from Dollar Tree. The little Lilo thing is not going to be hard to find. I mean, it's just a stuffed teddy bear. I just have to figure out how to make the the green dress. Hey, V. Linda, you say you miss me in Sacramento. Girl, me too, sometimes. Behavior issues can be draining, but I'm glad you go home and I don't want. I work for special school districts and I know about the little people attitudes. I'm trying to tell you, they will really pull you out of your character and act like you a ninja off the street, for real. I feel like, Shay, take it back. Don't say nothing. I've been learning to be real quiet and just annoy them. Do I come from a big family? Um, I guess you can kind of say I do, but the whole thing about the, that is, is that I've always lived with my mom, like, majority, majority of the time. So, I'm like, I really don't know, like, too much of my dad's family. I mean, I can tell we're all related because I'm like, we all kind of look alike, but I don't know. Sometimes people be on Facebook book. And they'd be like, hey, cousin. And I'd just be like, hey, cousin. You know, I'm like, are you really my cousin? Or like, I don't know. Do a couple's Halloween costume. Girl, I'm thinking about it. Well, yeah, I'm thinking about it. Because I was wondering, I'm like, well, what if he can dress up as like a... Uh, like a scary character and then I could be the woman scary character but I'm just like there is no woman character or a scary person so that's why I was thinking maybe we can carve pumpkins and then we can actually put the pumpkins on our head and then go take pictures like not in the forest or like the woods or maybe the woods might be cute but in the daytime. I don't know. We'll figure something out. So I kind of wanted to do it last year. But I didn't. And I thought it was too much. So maybe we might do something like that. Maybe I can be the scary. I mean the. Runaway person. I don't want to do Joker and Harley Quinn because I'm just like, I kind of did that last year with my ex. I don't want to have a repeater thing. You know, I want to do something different. So we're going to see. Right, so I'm just like, girl, you never know. <gasps> now see, this will be cute because I got those fishnets you know I'm like I got plenty of those and y'all know I can throw in a colored wig or something okay y'all so my wig is coming on Friday but what should I name her um the color that it says is called tangerine so, should my, like, alter ego name be, like, Tangerine or, uh, my coworker said Autumn. Either Tangerine, Autumn, and maybe one more. Like, what are other names for orange? Other names for orange. Right, that hey cousin can surprise you. I actually found blood related at my job this year. She's doing me, but we were both surprised. What? Um, can't use pumpkin because I already did pumpkin spice. Hey. Mm. 
I've already did a uh, cinnamon, maybe spice. Y'all know, like I have, I have, I like to have an alter ego name. Fall. You can see yourself like, hey, fall. What's up, girl? What's up, fall girl? What's up, girl, fall? Mm. Mm-hmm. Girl, come with the fishnets. I got to place another um, Sheen order, but I'm just like, I swear, like, every time I watch somebody's trying to haul from Sheen, Y'all just be buying clothes and stuff like that. Like, I like to explore on Sheen. If you really get into, like, their shoe section, Sheen got fucking stripper shoes. Like, they got stripper shoes. Because, baby, I'm going to figure out how to um put my little foot in them, and I'm going to stand up, and I'm going to take a motherfucking picture. Baby, and I'm going to edit the shit out that picture. I'm going to make sure it's in a different type of background. You don't see nothing. Baby, mm. tangerine, apricot, coral, peach, or uh, cherries, tropical punch, I mean, tropical fruit, sour orange, red, yellow, reveal, salmon, mm. tangy or tangerine. I'm kind of leaning more into tangerine. Slang for orange. What's another nickname for dark orange? Auburn ginger. Okay, I like Auburn or ginger. Cocoa peach. Did I did I show y'all the wig or no? This is this is what I bought. Remember this was this was sunshine. And I'm just like, oh. I'm like, I started to wait for October, but I'm just like, baby, forget that I'm finna do this shit now. We need to get into it. Mm -hmm, baby, melt that lace. Come on, little dark skin. Come on through, girl. Yeah. See, I looked at your last sheen haul and I actually have some items waiting in a card. Girl, you do? What you got? Dang, I can't pull up my sheen card because my card's on here on my iPad. But... Where is it? Mm. Ooh. Crush orange. Ooh, mango. Mmm. Now nah, I didn't think about that. Uh they were like, girl, can I get your number? What's her name? Mango. Mmm. I like that. Mm-hmm. She said flames. You know what, y'all? Y'all doing something. Okay. Mango Tango? Girl, you putting a little, uh, little sour punch in that one, huh? I hear you, girl. Oh, hell no. Y'all forgot to charge the iPad. Pause, you ready to go to bed? Mmm. Let me type in stripper shoes, because they got shoes in here. Baby, I got these in my car right now, and I got them in black. I think I got them in black or red. Can y'all see that? Them bitches got roses in it. Just imagine those. And for some reason, 
last year I had my nails all black and my toes all black and I really think black looks cute on my feet just imagine some black nail polish gel these shoes with them fishnets and a little something something maybe I should find me like one of those little outfits that like uh kind of like ruffles but it like flares you know so I'm like that way I can probably wear one of them like high up skirts but it ruffles out like the yellow set yeah but make that a different color excuse me okay so when you buy heels do you buy them in your your actual size or excuse me or what I'm good, Damon, because these come in a size 9, which I've heard some people say that they begin like 11. I'm like, damn, girl, you got some big-ass feet. Size up. They only go to a 9, though. Heels are half size bigger. Okay, well, all my shoes that I get from Sheen, I just, just kind of get them in a um, 41, which is a 9. But I'm like, I could have swore. Carry it. Beautiful, fits good, nice, but cute, true to size. Use it on being fast. That's the only way to be. You gotta live your best life. Baby, I'm trying to tell you. And you know how they always say, how they always say Halloween is the only time that you can be a hoe or, you know, slut or whatever and get away with it because you're dressing up as a character. But half of y'all motherfuckers be in character. <laughs> now nah, you have to size up because your feet slow and heels. Oh, Lord, let me get the baby oil ready because I'm finna slide my feet in these motherfuckers. And I'm gonna have my pinky toes inside the shoe and not outside the shoe like they be trying to play on. Like, them is cute. $43 and use the code. Baby, you win. Oh, yeah, I'm finna go shopping on here tonight. Matter of fact, I do have I do have to look at a couple of videos that I saved on YouTube because um, I want to put, like, some actual outfits together. Like, I want to try to give y'all shoes with the jacket or like the shirt, the pants or whatever have you, you know what I mean? And them is bad. Them is like, give me all the money you got. Give me all the money you got. Oh yeah. Oh, you said call her Blaze. <gasps> I got the name Mango Blaze. What do y'all think? Damn, they got a one piece swimsuit. You say look fab. Hell yeah, they do. What y'all think? Mango Blaze? Gwen, I think you owned to something. Look at here. Look at here. I'm finna hook y'all up. Well, they only go to a size large, but baby, some of y'all gonna make it fit. Okay? Just imagine if that was a, a chocolate girl. Oh, yeah. 
I'm gonna find some for the plus size. I don't even know how we even got over here to the large section. See, that's why, yeah. I'm gonna help y'all get on y'all's uh, Halloween stuff. <gasps> that's super cute. I mean, it's a little skimpy, but... Did anyone hit the like button? Yeah, did y'all even hit the like button? Come on. Probably she turned the hell out there from. Hmm. Thank you, Crystal. Y'all, we are almost at 47,300 people in the palace. We at 279. Um, maybe, just maybe, we might be at 48 by the end of the year. I don't know about 50,000. That's a lot of damn people, but... And you know what I've been doing, too? So, um, the other day, I went to Taco Bell, right? And so, the lady, she was real, real nice. And she was like, can you fill out this survey? Yada, 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 this and that. And I said, yes, I sure will. And she was like, I'm going to come back with your, uh, with your Baja Blast. I said, okay. So, I got in my purse. And I wrote down plus size shade. And I pushed this crowd with a little heart. And I told her, find me on YouTube. Baby, neck working. Neck working. And I did do the survey for her too. I'm like, that's how you neck work. And also, I used to uh, pass out my little stickers like when I would send y'all stuff. I'm like, I might have to find somebody or maybe I should go to like FedEx or somewhere and print me off some stickers. And you know like people be putting their little wrap stickers on the... Um, the drive through and stuff, and you know, people just be sitting there waiting and be looking around, you know, twiddling their thumbs and stuff. They be like, hmm, who is that? Plus, I share on YouTube? What? Because, you know, like, I, a lot of people don't know me out here in STL. I mean, y'all know me because I'm like, y'all live out here, but people like around here, they don't recognize me. Sometimes they just be like, oh, that's a cute little fat girl. Because, you know, I'm like, I be in my hair and, you know, makeup and stuff done, you know, and I be going out. But that's all they know. Don't nobody recognize me. So, I'm going to have to start neck working. And that's what I do. Now, I didn't, um, I'm kind of, I'm kind of glad that I didn't, um, get that little sticker and put it on my car. And, you know, you know, like people just be having like little tags and stuff on their car in their window. I'm like, good thing I didn't put plus size shade on there because I'm just like, what if people just be following me, follow me home or some shit, you know? I mean, you just never know. So I'm like, well, good thing I didn't do it, but I might have to, you know, do something. Somebody said for real, LOL, income low as hell on here. Y'all talking about buying stamps. Go apply for your own food stamps. Motherfuckers got kids. It ain't nothing to fill out some papers to see if y'all get accepted. <laughs> That's the real hype, ain't it? Uh, y'all, they've been tripping me out all day. What? Yeah, that's crazy. It's been 11 years since my cousin been gone. Mm. I remember growing up with him, and it was me and my daddy. We went somewhere. I don't know where we went, but I knew he was with me, and I was just like, I think that's the last time I seen my cousin. Mm. 
Oh, but Gwen, um, what would you like me to cook so I can make a cooking video? Girl, I ain't. Girl, I got some, um, ooh, Friday, October 14th, Party in the Patch. Where is Clayton and Brentwood at? Shaw Park and Brentwood. Hello, LYD. Hey, Internet. Yeah, I'm on Facebook. They must have heard me because they got events coming up. Winter Wonderland Walk. Okay, I'm interested. Main Street Glow. Oh, we interested in that. Oh, there it go. Okay, so my coworker was telling me that they had a Halloween um, cruise. So basically, it's two hours and 30 minutes. And I guess you get on this little tugboat or whatever, and I guess you chug your ass across the St. Louis water, the Mississippi water at that, because it's a little muddy. Hey, sexy BBW. Scare up some fun for Halloween costume party cruise. Dance to a DJ, enjoy light, horrors, device, and cash bar and complete costume contest. The winter will see two tickets to our New Year's Eve cruise. Okay. Cruise is from 9 to 11.30. Boards at 8.30. Okay. I put I'm interested in that. St. Charles Oktoberfest. What are we feasting on? What? Okay. When does... Oh, it's in two days? Damn, they'll be playing around. You know what? That's crazy. You said take 170 to Brentwood exit. Take 170, 170. Is 170, 270 or no? I was just asking my um, homegirl was she gonna go to a uh, barbecue on the river. I've been, I'm trying to look for like events and stuff in St. Louis that way, you know, like I can go cause I missed one that I could have went to the other day. But, Facebook heard me talking. Let me check my thing. Okay, we got 7%. Facebook heard me talking. So I'm trying to see, like, events and stuff that I can go to, like, when I'm off work. Hey, Monique. Mm. St. Charles is kind of far. But... I'm putting in the rest of here so that way they can pop up. Okay. Food trick September 23rd. Oh, I'm off work. Hey, Brianna. Oh, excuse me. Patty's Festival of Lies. Interested. Ferguson Street Fest. Fuck it. Interested. What is this? The Rocky Horror Drag Brunch Live at Tropical Liquors. The Coors. I can't cook seafood. Well, I mean, I can't cook seafood, but I'll be the only one eating it. Mr. Man's allergic to seafood. And bananas. We would like to live and take a strange journey. Let's wrap it around. Mm. I think this is a a drag show. Well, I'm interested. I'm going to that too. I would like to go to a um well I don't work on the weekends, but maybe we can see 
We'll probably take our clients to like um, a pumpkin patch or something. We're probably gonna have a party on Saturday because one of my clients' birthday is on Saturday. He will be 40 something. Well, I won't be there for the party because I work that night at 10, but for me, I would take 270 West to 170 South and take 170 South to Brown Oaks Line. Oh, okay, I'm gonna have to get on 270 then. Mm -mm. Damn. Yes, we're having a birthday party or, or something. We'll see. Mm. Bike Fest, October 13th to the 16th. Okay, we might can go to that. Not sure, but Highway 40 probably will get you there. Uh, you know what? I don't think I ever been on Highway 40. Shut up. Why are you coming in here? Uh -huh. Never mind. Okay. <laughs> that was just so scary. Well, can you cook a homemade pizza? I did that one. Mm. I don't know. You'll figure out something for me, Glenn. I got some neck bones there, but I'm like, that's too basic. I'll probably go through my um my TikTok thing and see what I saved. Oh my god! I don't eat no gator. Y'all yeah, probably have to go get off here because my iPad's on 5%. And it's going to kick y'all off in a minute. Um, let me see. Definitely Friday we will be going live. Uh, yeah. Friday we'll go live. Mm, that's, an, that's a good one. Now that one I can do. Let me look up a recipe. Unless y'all know a recipe, y'all can send me. Well, I'm here. But, yeah, if y'all have a recipe, send me the recipe. Um, I'm going to have to look in, to see if Walmart actually sell these uh, type of dumplings. But definitely Friday Live is coming Saturday. Um, I guess I can um, do the week because it's supposed to be here Friday. I can do that for Saturday. That way y'all have something to watch on Saturday. Um, Sunday. If I cook something by Sunday or we make something special at work, I'll try to give y'all a... Um, uh, a Sunday meal, maybe. But I'm like, it probably won't even be Sunday. It'll have to be the following Sunday because it's going to be too late by the time I cook and upload it. But I make sure y'all get something. Um, I still got some other stuff to do. I just been at work early, so I can't do everything. You know I am. No, I did not work on Sundays from 10 a.m. to 10 p.m. So, yeah, and, you know, we can turn on the TD Jakes or, you know, anybody on the TV, YouTube, whatever. So, yeah, but I enjoyed y'all's company for tonight. Um, I'll see y'all Friday. Um... We're going to try to pay, play Family Feud. 
I don't know how I'm going to do it, but I'm about to figure it out now so that way I can be prepared myself. Because I already downloaded it. I just need to figure out how to uh, do it. Because I'm either I'm going to have to sit my iPad up on the stand and I can mirror, I can screen mirror my iPad to the TV. That way y'all can see it on the TV and... Y'all can just tell me what to type in the uh, in the comments, and we'll see. But if we can't do it on here, I would do it on TikTok or Instagram. But I'll still go live on YouTube, and then I'll just say the question out loud, and then y'all can give me the answer. And then I can probably just, like, flash to whatever device back and forth. So that way y'all can still see it, and it won't get copyrighted. So that way... Maybe y'all can go back and watch it. I did have a few people tell me that they either want to play Family Feud or we can do like a couples. Um, I forgot what, what game they called it. They said I probably have to go um, buy the game. It was good chatting with you too. What was it? Uh, oh, the card... The game is called uh, mm, Culture Tag. And I was like, is it an app? She's like, no, it's a game. So S-C-B-I-G-Y-S-T-C-A is the answer. Stop crying before I give you something to cry about. So we're going to have to uh, find that and play that game because I think that would be very, very interesting. Cause you know how like uh what what what's that girl name, little Jake? No, her name ain't little Jake. City girls. I forgot what she said, but you know how she had that long ass fucking stretch of letters, and they was like, "Can you read this?" Girl, I always do. Yep, J T. I don't know why I call her little Jake. Maybe I'm missing the shy. No, well, I mean, the couple game would be like, I will read the question and then y'all will answer it. So it's just like, okay, for instance, I tried to do something like this, like in my thought process in my head, like, does it matter if your spouse makes more money than you? Do you feel a certain type of way or does that bother you? Or like, you don't care because both y'all making money and money is money. Too much fun. This the homeboy or no? He cool. Yeah, he's doing he's doing good. He's back playing uh basketball. Yes, yeah, so I'm like, we can we you know we can do the game like that. So it's just like, you know, a little stuff. Damn I'm trying to figure out who that is. Too much fun ninety. How long is that little Pac Man or no? How long? Too much fun. Who are you? 90. Who is that? That's little Pac Man or no? I got 4%. <laughs> Dang. That must not be you then. You ain't said nothing. Oh. No, you good. I, I, no, somebody else got a name like you. And I thought that was you. I said, my boy, I thought you was in jail. <laughs> oh, shoot. No, girl, I love you too. Palace, where are you? Are you in the bed? 
No, I know you're not in the bed. You need to get in the bed, though. You finna go to bed? Okay. Probably on the floor somewhere. You want me to call it? All right, y'all about to get off here for my iPad to die. It's ringing. I love you guys. I'll see y'all Friday. Okay. Good night, everybody. I'll see y'all tomorrow. Can't show, show y'all my shirt. That's the company's name. Good night, everybody. I appreciate talking to y'all. Y'all have a good night. I hope y'all have a good week and continue until Friday so we can let loose. Okay, girl. Get ready for the weekend. Buy too much fun. Gwen, Sexy BW, Brianna, Antoinette, uh, Diamond. Who else in here? Damn. Uh, Genovisky, Kelly, Purple Ladybug. Who else in here? Damn, Gwen been talking her head off. She can hear the whole conversation. LYD, Damon, B. Chris, Bye Crystal, Bye Kenya, LS, uh, Fatima, good night, honey, good night, Kalia, D, Jaden's mommy, LS. Who else in here? Butterfly 89. Come and say goodnight. Girl, get your big head out the camera. <laughs> Good night, y'all.